is Kim Kardashian a bad catch? No. To be a woman. A good she catch. Is that a good catch? I think yeah. she's a good catch because she got that paper. I think so too. So the paper makes her a good catch. You m- right. Oh no. Kira. Maybe I should be a super villain. Superville back with another classic. In today's video, Corey Holcomb implies that a woman with promiscuous reputation holds some value and regards Kim Kardashian as an appealing catch, primarily because of her financial status. Is Kim Kardashian a bad catch? No. To be a woman? She is. is she a she bad is. catch? I won't you don't think, think she about is? That. No. You think she's a good catch? For a man. Kim Kardashian. Yes. Kim Kardashian. Is she a bad catch? She, uh, listen, she's turned prostitute into main prostitution into mainstream. She showed. She didn't. She her showed, mother did. She picked her out. <laughs> yeah, but she showed how to be a hoe can work. And make. Wh- wh- but I saw the why movie. Make, why be a broke hoe? Why be a broke hoe? I don't know if I, 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 I want to marry a hoe, though. But you don't know that they're a hoe. When they're. In private, they don't tell you. You probably fucked a woman who already fucked this 50 niggas be. and didn't tell nobody, but she's fucking getting she's paid. She's a public hoe. She's right. a public hoe, and, wow. she, and she is showing off the, the spoils. Keep in mind that this lady was Corey's wife at the time. I saw the movie Trading Places, and Dan Aykroyd was down <laughs> on his luck, uh-huh. and old girl played a hoe. Oh, and yeah. she the one who got him back on his feet. A hoe with right. the heart of gold. So when you are judging hoes... So are you telling me a hoe makes a really great woman? What I'm saying is... Well, she has a lot of money. And hoe, she likes you. A mm. hoe can help you. A hoe can help you. Mm. A hoe can help you. Kind of like a life coach. <laughs> I mean, a hoe know a lot of shit. This is deep. <laughs> a hoe know a lot of shit. What it is, I think a lot of men want the ideal woman that hasn't been passed around mm. so he can feel like he got something that's all his own. Right. And you that's but what it doesn't happen legally, in right. You right. can't be fucking 10 year olds legally. So you, so since wow. that's really not an option, you <laughs> might as well. I'm, I'm just saying, like nowadays it goes, the, the age has lowered. There's a lot you of You can't men. really get a female who hasn't fucked around a lot. Yeah, there's uh, a lot of men who yeah, think they're, they're, they're fucking early not early. married to a hoe. Right. Wow. <laughs> like I, I would marry but, a hoe. But, but that goes back. The, they don't know the vaginal history. Of right. Who right. They That's married. the difference. That, and that goes back public. to the point I make in reverse to men. I tell women, stop dating your ideas and date a real man. You know, I tell men the same thing. Just because she's presented in a certain package, j- that doesn't mean you really know who this person oh, is. I feel like Kanye went and got with um, the Kardashian lady. Just to try to make it seem like he got somebody of status. Yeah, and see, and so was and, he the status jacker? That's what it sounds like to me. Kind it sounds like he's a status jacker from somebody whose status, in my opinion, is lower than his. And at the end of the day, there's the, 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 who are we to judge? It could be real love. It could be authentic. It could be true. It could be the person for him. But at the end of the day, when you have a superficial basis, you know, to work from. Chances are that relationship ain't gonna last. It ain't gonna. It ain't. It ain't gonna. It ain't gonna stay because it's based off of superficiality. I mean, I, I look at Kim Kardashian. I don't think she's a dumb broad, but she she doesn't seem to be the type of person that's gonna hold my attention for any no longer than five or ten minutes unless she gets naked. So what else can she bring to the table other than her celebrity, other than her status? How does she help she some her money. pussy and her money? What, 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 what? Pussy. I mean, there's more pussy women? on the planet than. There's water. But we don't have come any man, special. So you think most men have a woman who that has more qualities than their pussy? I'm, I'm just I'm not calling most what I'm women saying dumb. Is, I'm just saying what, like what, what I'm saying is men seem to pussy, think that that's unique. That that's not that. What I'm saying is pussy is so abundant for men that it's more. It's like a side dish. But hold on. So is it or is it just you pick that. the pussy? That's one. <laughs> pussy is everywhere. Yes. No doubt. But. Why do equal. people settle for one pussy in particular? I think maybe that's why you can't say all pussy is the same. It might be literally the same, mm. but it's not the same to everybody. Well, like this pussy, again, I want to be with this pussy, but I want to fuck that pussy. But I think when when I want to be with the pussy, that means there are other intangibles that are connected to it. And that's it could what be, I want to know. Can you give us some examples of a woman yeah. that's so with? Um, value other than a pussy hole? First off, she's got to be 
introspective. She has to be smart. This is the 5150 show. Yes. You fucked our callers up with that they got Okay, they Explain got Explain introspective. They think that <laughs> think bitch can deeply. shoot a ray gun. <laughs> I'm a fan of Corey, but after years of following his content, I've noticed a pattern. When he's unsure of a word's meaning or something else, he tends to shift the focus onto his fans, suggesting that they lack understanding. All right, let's do it another way. She <laughs> can't oh! deeply. Let's do it another way. Let's do it another way. Uh, right, the victim blames, right? The accountable person claims. Whenever I'm with a woman who can claim her shit, that's a sign of strength. And to me, it'll make the sex action better mm. because I know it's not about what I did or I'm here to save you from your situation. We're, you, so you understand? You didn't wait a minute. I, say I farted when you was eating. No, no, wait. wait. <laughs> so the difference is you want a I woman who's that. not going to nag you and, and criticize you. I mean, that that's really, I if want you a said woman, she can claim her own shit, she yes. won't bother you. Yes. And you can fuck her without... The drama. Right. And I want her to be intelligent. I want her to be flexible. I, I mean, there's research out there that'll tell you relationships that last have flexible beliefs. When the beliefs are inflexible, that's where conflict comes. Because you got two people that believe something when they start this motherfucker. But at the end of the day, people are always changing and growing and evolving. So if your beliefs aren't doing the same thing, your relationship will find a space where there's conflict. That's what's going to happen. So beliefs have to be flexible. She has to be open to new ideas. She's got to read well, yeah, but not a fucking magazine. Not a goddamn Pop Sugar website. You got to read <laughs> something. What about Facebook? Can she read uh, Facebook? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Shorty just... Long show got canceled. Did you know that? <laughs> Did you know? <laughs> That's on my timeline. No, you got to read. And, and, and I'm just saying, there has to be a spiritual pursuit in the woman. To me, that enhances the sex act. That what is spiritual? What is that? Okay. What I mean by spirituality, I don't mean a religion religious hypocritical zealot jesus is good right it on sunday but then on saturday let jesus me suck you dick. Wait. <laughs> right you know what i mean it i want a person that's authentic in themselves and, and, and it's, it's hard to find man it's hard to find you got a lot of actors and actresses out there playing the part for each other and then faking it until they making it until the relationship breaks down mm-hmm that's, you know, and I respect that. A lot of stuff you Yeah, you, come on, Auntie. Give me some. Deep. Come on, Auntie. <laughs> yeah. ah. uh, I don't know about that. Uh, uh, no, I mean, I respect that that's what you want. That's what I want. Yeah, yeah and, and, and what everybody wants is different because I want somebody to understand that I know what the fuck I'm talking about <laughs> every time I open my motherfucking mouth. Whether I'm right or wrong, you need to listen to what the fuck I say. I'm like Prince Father in Purple Rain. <laughs> you do what I say. That's what I want. <laughs> <laughs> Don't I keep the heat on? Oh God! <laughs> Are you saying, Corey, that in your relationship, Except I ain't gonna blow my brains out? You're a tyrant. What is a tyrant, though? It's your way or the highway. Is that the definition of tyrant? I'm gonna look that shit up. Look it up. Are you tyrannical in your rule? I thought a tyrant is a new tire. Okay. So, it talks a lot. He just playing. Come on now. A tyrant. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I'm a tyrant, though. I think I'm a flexible guy, like you said, but yeah. um, I just know what the fuck I'm doing out here. Right. right. <laughs> you know what I mean? No, I get it. Look, what what look. kind of guy are you looking for, Auntie? <laughs> One who will do my bidding. Wow. Now she's a tyrant. Okay, yeah. yeah. That is a tyrant. Yeah. yeah that shit. Anyway, we got to get ready to take a break. I want everybody to think about that shit I said, though, about the, the uh, Kim Kardashian. Is that a good catch? Is that a good catch? I think yeah. she's a good catch because she got that paper. I think so, too. So the paper makes her a good catch. You motherfucking right. So right? then that means Vanessa uh A rich Kobe's- hoe is always better than a broke hoe. <laughs> Remember that. Yeah.